hello my lovies please follow and subscribe okay so this is my snails they are neatly washed and put in a pot ready for preparation so guys let's make delicious pepper snails together pepper snails so i had my snails in a pot i put in some salt to, uh, to taste and maggie ah very strong very strong oh i needed the hammer but i had none like we all said like we all have been saying hammer is not needed so i just need to put in my maggi there i put water for it to boil and dissolve itself i have no hammer next time i'll be buying hammer so the sinus is boiled i now put in the uh, pepper and onions to blend i've blended it i put it now in the pot for it to cook and then i forgot paprika just opened in my freezer my fridge and i saw this paprika paprika is needed so i'm not blending the paprika look at it it's blending so nicely it's blending it's Cutting my blender is cutting it, and now my blender has succeeded in crushing it. And I add it to my mix of uh, my uh, tomatoes, pepper, and uh, onion paste. Let it boil, let it cook. I stir it up, stir it up, covered it, checked it again to, to make sure it has the right paste because I wanted it to be really thick. Now I'm adding my sinus in it, adding my sinus so well, mixing it, mixing it. Mix it again, mix it up so the paste goes around it. It's well mixed. I covered it and I'm checking if it is well cooked again. Yeah. <laughs> you cover it to see well cooked again and that you have the right consistency of paste you want. If you want to watch, if you want to take. Now I'm adding white pepper, poivre blanc for the francophones. I'm mixing it. The white pepper gives it a very nice flavor. Try this. A very nice flavor. You will love it. Adding onions. And now I'm adding vegetable cooking oil. I don't need so much oil, so I'm just adding a little bit of the cooking oil. So I'm giving it that nice mix for everything to be even. Putting in my cooking oil, you can see. Put in a little bit. After putting your cooking oil, you cover the pot again. And then we have a pet sinus ready. Join me and comment if you and like the recipe. now have a first bite. I'm enjoying it. It's so yummy and tasty. If you have sinews, please try this recipe. And if you have any question in regards to the recipe, please, please, please don't hesitate to comment below in the comment section and I will answer all your questions. Like you all know, sinews are very nutrition, nutritional to the body. Buy some sinews and try this. Bye!